I'm talking about none other than um, an artist known as Observ Observ Observative Baringo Artist. And of course, his real name is Ronald Kimutai. Kimutai, your CV is so, can I say so rich at your age? Like from an engineer, you get employed. Then you're like, stuck a job. Yeah. Who does that? Uh, at this age and era, when people are looking for jobs, mm -hmm. who does that? Only people who want to own it. So you want to own it? Yeah, I, I, I want to own. Uh, I want to own who I am, mm -hmm. and I want to own who I, what I do, mm -hmm. and I want to own what I have. Mm -hmm. uh, I have a gift that I was given by God, that is to 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 write music and poetry, and I also have a gift uh, that I was enabled by school. I have studied and I have engineering knowledge. And I also have a gift to design concepts for community development, and uh, that's what I use uh, so that I can enrich people, inspire people, so that they can become better, mm -hmm. and also um, so mm -hmm. that they can shape their own society as well. Okay, observative uh, artist. Why the name observative? Why the name observative? Yeah. I do observe. Oh, so you observe? Yeah, I do observe. <laughs> you see what's the missing link? Yeah, do I, your thing. exactly. I, I do observe, I see the gaps, and then I design a solution to fill in the gaps. Wow. Yeah. Artist, mm -hmm. singing, then you do poetry also at the yes, same time. When did you start on. doing this? Uh, you don't tell me, Nikiwa mm -hmm. High School, uh -huh. Ukikosa High School, Unarudi Prime, Ukikosa Prime, <laughs> Unenda Nilikuwa Choir, Chat Sunday School. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, Yako Nigani. So, uh, for me, the first time, um, the first time I did write a song, or actually thought of a song, was I was in class six. Classics. I was going to school early in the morning around six, and I was whistling a tune, and then I arrived at school, and I write down the music. So you That was the first time I ever did. So that. your focus was you read the school at six? Yes. Then just write music? Yeah, then write music during that prep. Not time. even study? I wasn't studying at that time. The music was still in my head. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I had to write it down before it could uh, vanish. Can we just give us a sample of your music, by the way? A sample of my music? Yeah. Okay, why, why don't I do a uh, spoken word piece in Pokot? Okay. Spoken word piece in Pokot. Yes. Now I'm just wondering, a sign language interpreter, Susan Soko, yeah. <laughs> whether she'll be able to do this, you know, for our uh -huh. special viewers. Susan, Papa uh Kunakazi -huh. Leo, poetry uh -huh. in? In Pokot. In Pokot. Yes. Okay. Um. Usini ulize mbona silale. Nulize mbona siko Brazil, Rio. Nilitikia wito. Kuja mlima wa Kamrio, oteka kore, ngoma somo, teramu wa wak, arawor nyo karam somo not, teramu wa wak. Ngaga achi, mita negongo tich, kenyichete, kiruk murenyo somo not, kiteka masomo, kesika ketesata kora pokot, teramu wa wak. Oere kwa kalia, bade ni kisemevu unajibu awoy. Awoy? Yeah. Okay, I'll try. Aya, oere kwa kalia. Awoy. Kiteka masomo. Awoy. Okay, what am I saying? <laughs> I'm just saying awoy. I don't even know what I'm no, saying. In, in Pokot, when you say awoy, uh, unaitikia. Oh, so unaitikia. awoy. Eh, awoy, unaitikia. Like, yes. But then, you know, you sound like you're speaking uh -huh. hot English. Yeah, I was mixing. Yeah, I started with a bit of English and then I delved into Pokot. Into po so that's yeah. how you... So in short, mm -hmm. is it like your poetry is more of like your dialect, use your dialect to do poetry? Yeah, I, I actually use that dialect specifically to reach out to the Pokot community on mm -hmm. how they, on emphasis on education. Emphasis on education. Yeah, because I'm saying kiteka masomo, kesika ketesata kura Pokot. Let us build education or uh -huh. let us uh, embrace education mm -hmm. so that we can progress mm -hmm. as the people of Pokot. If you didn't get anything, just remember our way. Yes, awoy. Awoy. It means yes in Pokot. You know, in my mother tongue, it means something totally different. <laughs> <laughs> so let me stick to your meaning. Yes. But anyway, it just means like a, like a, like a boy. It means a boy. Awoy. Awoy. It means yeah, like it a means boy. A, yeah, it means uh -huh. a boy. Okay. Yeah. So I'll stick to your meaning. Mm -hmm. That so, is Pokot. That is now. Mine awoy is yes in Pokot. What is yours? Mine. It simply means a boy. In in which language you now? Uko nyanza. Uko nyanza. Yeah, okay. it simply means a boy. Okay, a boy. so. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, you you do poetry, yes. but I'm also sure you do music. Yeah, I do yeah. music. Uh -huh. 
Can you just probably sing for us your best music that you've done and you feel like this is what has sold me out? So the, the best music is my recent uh, publishing, which is called I Will. I Will. Yes. Uh -huh. I Will. Point it on the map, pen it down, cover the ground all the way to the crown and I Will. Not lose sight of the light to the end of the tunnel. Yes, I will sit and plan, then go get it done. Count my cash. Yes, I will stop it. Nothing till I meet my goals. And I will be someone, a warrior for a cause, a soldier for the truth, a cobbler for your shoes, a teacher to the youth. And I will mentorpreneurs, work is you, kutana the blood of Jesus. Break loose the chains over na Paul na Silas. Nitoki teki kipchoge to the corners of the earth. Spread the word like virus. Wow, the passion that you have yeah. simply tells or uh -huh. shows that you really love what you're doing. Yes, I do. So for how long have you been doing music? For how long have I been doing music? Yeah. I've been writing since class six. Mm -hmm. I was writing songs, singing, and then I wrote my first rap when I was in Form 1, and then I did. Oh, you know, you come rap, dining, yes, entertainment. Uh -huh. days. I'm only quite drama festival. I, mean, I, was, I, was, I was very, very timid at high school, so uh -huh. I, I actually really started performing after high school. Uh -huh. uh, performing rap freestyles and started writing poetry and performing uh -huh. uh, spoken word poetry. Uh -huh. uh, I started. Um, a mentorship, uh, a talent mentorship program in Eldamaravil called Wenyewe Poetry. I mm -hmm. also did a talent development program in Igaton University known as Fosam, specifically for poetry and all performing artists. Mm -hmm. And it's still going on to, till today. So at the end of the day, your focus is music that uh, transforms life. Yes. Uh, for, for me, when I was growing up, I lacked the, the mentorship that could lead me to, uh, say, uh, somebody that could hold my hand in music or in my, in my talent. Mm -hmm. So I, as I grew in it, I started thinking more about these other ones that are coming after me. So I started focusing on talent mentorship. Mm -hmm. And then the first time I went to East Pokot and saw how um, uh, illiteracy is so, so high, that's the first time I thought, uh, well, maybe the mentorship could not just be on, on talents, mm -hmm. but it could be more than just talent. So I developed a model called Kuwa Mwenyewe Mentorship. Mm -hmm. And this Kuwa Mwenyewe Mentorship is about building uh, your personal competency mm -hmm. and also uh, building the individual so that they can recognize they are who they are, okay. what gifts they have that mm -hmm. they have that God has given them, mm -hmm. and how they can use it and shape their society better. Okay. Yes. Um, you know, someone is wondering, you have yeah. something on your lap. Yes, I do have yeah. something on my lap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do have a t-shirt. So, so just explain to us yeah. what this t-shirt is all about. And now, this t-shirt is uh, called Camrio. Mm -hmm. Camrio Armamenta t-shirt. Mm -hmm. Yes, Armamenta. And uh, this is a hoodie. Aha. Camrio, Cam then behind written. Na jua wengine saizi wana ona tu iwe menitosha. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah. Uh, why do I have this is yeah. um, I started the, uh, a model Kwamunye mentorship program in East Pokot known as Camryo Mentorship. Mm -hmm. Now the purposes of Camryo Mentorship is to advance efforts towards realizing education for every Pokot child. Uh, from the statistics that we have uh, uh, from, from the records that have been written or, uh, or published is East Pokot is above 90% illiterate. Mm -hmm. And uh, even from the students that we mentor there, you realize that a majority of, a majority of them are representing, are representing their families. You may find like one child out of a family of say 10 children mm -hmm. is only going to school. So you, you may find that there's a huge discrepancy in terms of how many, uh, how many kids are going to school. Mm -hmm. So uh, how, we, how we are advancing these efforts towards realizing the education of every Pokot child is through mentorship, mm -hmm. so that we ensure that those who are in school yeah? Mm -hmm. uh, they transit to the next so level. So you you you, pre, you 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 make a you what you have the shirts and yes. the uh -huh. and the jumper. Yes. So the money you get from it yeah, goes so, to the foundation. Yeah. So we sell this and okay. then uh, the money that comes from this is generated uh -huh. and goes to for, to the foundation and facilitates the mentorship program. Okay. And, and in addition to it, we have a uh -huh. talent development program over there, and we also have an enterprise development for the women. Mm -hmm. Yes. And just before I'd, I'd request my uh, I'd request yeah. my producer Samugo, just to give us um, a sample of your music that's going to be played in a few minutes. Uh -huh. How do you juggle in between, because mm -hmm. we're running out of time, how do you juggle in between mm -hmm. um, you being an artist, mm -hmm. you being a farmer, mm -hmm. and you, you know, being a community developer? And me being a community developer. Yeah. Uh, I believe my purpose is to inspire. 
and to build uh, people to be better. Mm -hmm. uh, so I am basically a mentor. Now as a mentor, I, I fuse my engineering skills and knowledge and I fuse my artistic tendencies, uh, writing and performing poetry and music, mm -hmm. and the ability to develop concepts that can translate to programs mm -hmm. that can actually uh, impact the community and fuse them and do something that is uh, incorporating all those. Mm -hmm. uh, here, is, here is one, uh, my engineering. Uh, we, we did an, an enterprise development for the mothers in East Pokot, a model uh, drip irrigation system. I was the one who designed it and I was the one who installed it. And I actually brought together all the kids we were mentoring mm -hmm. so that I can teach them how education can actually be of value to their community. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what happened is, um, the drip irrigation worked very well. Uh, last year, uh, you, you remember we had a, a, a long season, a long dry season from yeah. January to May, yeah. and that is what supplied the food in the mm -hmm. community, and it made a difference. Okay. Yes. And I mean, <coughs> for all those young people outside mm -hmm. there, this is just from me, so from Kimutai. Yeah. Like you're telling me about your life, and I'm just wondering: the people who graduated, they mm -hmm. don't have a job, they've given up. Mm -hmm. Others don't even want to start their own businesses; they mm -hmm. don't want to be entrepreneurs. Yeah. But you decided, like, I need to quit and mm -hmm. decide to help the community. Yeah? Yes. So I mean. You're, you're such an encouragement to so many young people. As you're winding up, mm -hmm. the, your camera should be done on my right. Yep. Just a message to young people. Then from mm -hmm. there, um, mm -hmm. I request a producer, Mugo, just to wind up this show with your music. Yeah, your okay. camera should be done on my right uh -huh. in like a minute. In like a minute. Yeah, because we've run out of time. Whoa, Sasawa. Okay, so first of all, to every young person out there, you know you have something that God has given you, a gift that you can use. Tafadali, own it. Kuwa mwenyewe. And to everybody out there who feels can support this program, remember that you can check out our website www.comonyewe.org, see what we are doing, and you can donate or actually purchase our products or even come and sponsor some of the programs that we are doing in East Pokot. And even if you cannot do that, you can support through the music that I'm doing. Wow, wow. I'm sure the guys will be sending me messages. I need the jump, I need the t-shirt. Apana, akuna chabure. You yeah. have to support. You have yes. to support Ronald Kim Tai. We've been speaking to Ronald Kim Tai, mm -hmm. an artist, a farmer, a community yeah. developer who's yes. trying to change the community where he comes from. Mm -hmm. That is El Damaravin, but right now you're in Nakuru County, but yes. you go all the way to Baringo County just to transform lives. So right now, mm -hmm. I'd like to leave you with his video his music video have a look at what he does apart from just farming and helping the community he does music he does poetry so and let's the have... music was shot in east pokot in east pokot and the music features... community nayo yes <laughs> and, and, the... East pokot. and the music features exactly what you're doing in east okay. pokot um the, there's me okay. the mentor and there's the mentee okay so, so let's uh -huh. have a look at the video as we wind yeah. up star guest thank you so much for watching Cover the ground all the way to the crown and I will not lose sight of the light to the end of the tunnel. Yes, I will sit and plan then go get it done. Count my cash and I will stop at nothing till I meet my goals and I will be someone, a warrior for a cause, a soldier for the truth, a cobbler for your shoes, a teacher to the youth and I will mentor preneurs, wreck is you, put another blood of Jesus, break loose the chains, on by na Paul na Silas, ni toke teke keep choke to the corners of the eyes, spread the word like virus. Yali yo puta sindwala, no mani giza. Tazama mbele Usife moyo Tiyabidi Kuwa mwenyewe I will get there Nitafika I will get there Nitafika Sife moyo Nitafika Let the never see me boil. 
Nitafanya kila jibudi kuwafikishia ujumbi wale nisi mfano teuli Nitakuja nikitenda we maneza nguri Kesho ya mtanyueka kwenye orodha ya wahenga Nitakuja kwa site love design and plan amwende